So um, the the information about about Guinness mm -hmm. is there something in particular that you want me to talk about? Um, not really. It's just nope. you know, you know, it should be just generally speaking about how you feel and how it fits with barbecue because people don't really normally um, think about having Guinness with the barbecue, right. and it would be really nice if you could just emphasize, mm -hmm. you know, that it, it goes great with barbecue, with um, real barbecue. Yeah, it's just that we want to unlock the opportunity with mm -hmm. the meal locations from the artist's perspective. So, you know, you don't have to be. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. So it's like the initial reaction. Mm -hmm. By the way, uh, it's artificial. So. Guinness is still made only in, in uh, Ireland, right? Mm. Good. Yeah. I know there's some. It's the identity. There's some brands now that, uh, like uh, Whole Garden. Yeah. Obi makes it here. Mm -hmm. in, in so Egypt. that's disappointing, oh. right? They have a good brewery, but uh, you're losing the uh, provenance, the uh, terroir. Heritage. Her heritage, right, in the terroir. Mm -hmm. But Korea is more like craving if it's like uh, originally from the outside country or. Uh, yeah, if it's from outside country. They prefer. They prefer uh, but I think, I think. And it tastes different. Right, mm -hmm. it does. Oh. What I do notice though is that uh, Koreans generally don't read the label. Right, right. So the, uh, most Koreans don't realize that Tamisa and Tomsu don't have sugar added. Yeah. Did you know that? No. And also did you know that Tamisa and Tomsu has only 1% of right, right, sugar? Right, right, right. And the rest is Judah? Right, right, right. Yeah. right, right. Anyway, and it's really cheap, by the way. But nobody actually cares about like Koreans. Exactly. They don't really care. I think they care. I just think that they um, don't know. They don't, don't know the information is there. And I think some of the the companies also have an effect on the law. So a few years ago, I remember seeing it said "sal jumushik sodu ilpro." Now it no longer says it just says because there's no regulation. There's no more regulation yeah, or they change the law. They don't have to have to state it. Yeah. Them. Anyway. Did you hear that Cus is gonna import their own right, right, from China? China? Yes. Really? They're gonna have a play with the yeah. regulations. Really? So they can they can get this tax. But they don't have to pay for it. Hi everybody, here I am at two uh, two, two horns. Two horns. Two horns. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. So two horns. It's a Korean beef. Beef. Anyway, beef. Korean beef barbecue restaurant done in Korean style. Uh, so kogi kui in in Korean. And I've been invited by uh, Diageo Korea and the Korea Herald to take part in this interesting food pairing, which will appear on the Korean Herald. So make sure you check out uh, koreaherald.com. Can we uh, toast Please. first? Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, hold on. That's it. Okay. Ready? Uh, <laughs> cheers. 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 Korea representative. I um, yes, I I'm from Diageo, Korea. I came here for corporate communications and very glad to say hi in front of everyone. I mean, I know um, there are a few hundred of subscribers who um, miss you still, and very nice to say hi here. She's the uh, queen of Guinness. Right. Well, uh, thank you for the invite. Oh, very no. nice to meet you. Alright uh, folks, I'm going to cut this out. Thank you for watching. Uh, we'll see you next time. Subscribe and uh, get subscribe. involved. Alright. Subscribe! <laughs> subscribe. <laughs> you guys gotta okay. some, like, Thank you. Thanks for watching Whiskey Whistle. Be sure to subscribe and don't forget to give this video a like and leave a comment down below. Be sure to stay tuned next time to join me, the host of the show, Mark, as I explore more whiskeys with you. Take care now and we'll see you next time.